guys welcome back to world illuminate 11 on this friday i hope you're having a great day and welcome if it is your first time checking out my channel and if it is your first time checking out the channel then please do hit the subscribe button you are very welcome here so this is a message for the divine masculines any divine masculines who watch the channel or may come across this video at some point it's a message of love support and guidance for you on your journey and i am picking up um, some fear coming in for, <clears throat> for the divine masculines. So this is message for of love and you know There may be things that you may be going on that may be going on in your life The angels are saying <clears throat> that it is you know, you are here You are loved you are supported and you are not alone on your journey So this is why I do these videos to give you that support and that love as well So, you know do always watch these videos because they are there to help you and you know share them far and wide to, with other divine masculines as well who may need to hear the messages that are there to guide them as well on their journey of life so we're going to see what the angels would like you to know and thank you for being here as well and for watching these videos because uh you know all i ever want to do is to be there to help others as well and you know you are giving me the chance to help you by actually being a by watching the video so thank you for watching and thank you for being here so we are going to bring in the almost tarot so thank you angels what messages are coming through for the divine masculines what messages are coming through for the divine my masculines okay and we're also going to bring in <clears throat> Uh, the divine masculine power messages thank you angels what messages are coming through for the divine masculines what messages are coming through for the divine masculines and we're also bringing in the angel prayers as well for you today by Carl gray thank you angels what messages are coming through for the divine masculines what messages are coming through what messages are coming through for the divine masculines okay so let's see what cards have come out here so a few cards have come out um so the first card that I can see here is about chaos. So, you know, you may be going through some sort of chaos in your life, sort of things going up and down as well. You know, like that roller coaster, you may feel like your life is like a roller coaster up and down things that are happening. And, you know, you may be feeling some fear as well uh, coming up in relation to that. The angels are saying, know that you are not alone and always know that, you know, when things go up and down like that, it is there to help you to learn certain lessons so that you can be able to move forward on your path as well so whatever may be going on in your life know that you are not alone and know that that chaos that is coming in is actually coming in to help you to then be able to grow come out from this place and really be able to move forward as well on your journey so know that you are not alone the angels are around you you know always invite them in they're always there to ready to help you so whatever you may be going through you're not going through it alone you've got your spirit guides and your angels with you invite them in and ask them to guide you and help you on your journey and the next card that has come out as well is the highs and lows so you may be feeling these highs and lows that are happening in your emotions as well. You know, sometimes you're feeling great and sometimes you feel really low. It's the same thing. It's the same sort of energy here about that chaos. The angels are saying, you know, everything is happening to help you to learn lessons so that you can grow and be able to really open up to your true authentic self. So, you know, when you are experiencing the lows, the angels are saying it's not about sort of just ignoring those emotions, you know, dig deeper and find out what it is why you're feeling the way that you're feeling because everything that is coming up whatever feelings that you may be having they're there to teach you something to help you to dig deeper into them to be able to work through them so that you can be able to feel better in yourself so the angels are saying those laws are actually messages coming through from your body from your higher self from from the angels to guide you to work on whatever you're feeling so that you can be able to get through it and come out on the other side so it is about you asking yourself why am i feeling the way that i'm feeling and really just going deeper and trying to find the answers because that is how you work on healing yourself and go deeper into those emotions as well don't ignore whatever may be coming up and not wanting to deal with it because it is coming up for a reason so that you can be able to deal with it and then work on releasing it so that's a powerful message that's coming through for you there from the angels 
The next card that came out is addictions. So you may be battling some certain addictions in your life. You know, this can be alcohol, it can be gaming, it can be working too much it can be um you know whatever it, that can be drugs it can be being on social media too much you know whatever that that may be this may be something that you may be uh wanting to work on releasing as well and the angels can help you to to do that you know you invite them in and you really sort of state that you know set the intentions to release these things because you know that you they're not uh for your highest good and it's about working on releasing them so that you can be able to move forward towards your highest good and to becoming your high your your true authentic self so when you release those things you know those addictions it helps you to become your true authentic self so call upon the angels they're there to help you to guide you to help you to release this so that you can be able to walk away from all these things that no longer serve you and the next card that has come out here is balance so when you release these things when you're working on healing yourself the, those low emotions that come up releasing the addictions walking away from the things that no longer serve you and you know and that is then helping you to find that balance in your life so you are working towards finding balance balance in your own energy as well balance in your masculine and feminine energy balance in all areas of your life you know doing everything in a balanced way rather than doing certain things to extremes that is all about releasing those things you know such as the addictions so that you can you become more in balance in your life so you know this can also be about finding the balance in your work and you know uh, sort of life in, in your work life you're having that work life balance as well and really sort of being in that place of balance so the angels are saying, you know, it is about you working towards finding that balance in all areas of your life, including your emotions as well. And then the next card that came out here is, is on gratitude. And, you know, yesterday was Thanksgiving for anyone who's in the in the U.S. You know, it was a day of Thanksgiving, but every day is a day of you being in a place of gratitude because the more you are grateful the more you're actually sending out that positive vibration to the universe that helps to bring in all the things that you desire. Look around your life. Even if you may have chaos happening, you know, highs and lows, ups and downs, and you may be feeling a lot of inner conflict going on, but always look at your life and see the things that are there in your life. You will always have something to be grateful for. You will be, you know, you are grateful today. Be grateful today for waking up on this day, this Friday, Friday that you've never seen before and that you never see again whenever you watch this but that particular day you know it is about that gratitude be grateful for being alive you know on this planet at this time be grateful for the fact that you are here to do a mission and you know and you are being prepared for that mission with all these highs and lows the chaos that is happening in your life it is all happening to help you to become your true authentic self to move towards becoming your the greatest version of yourself so that you can do the mission that you are here to do so you're going through this time of preparation with all those challenges that come in to help you to get to where you're truly meant to be so use gratitude. The more you are in that place of gratitude as well, it actually helps to uplift your spirits. So if you are feeling low, if you start to look at the things that are in your life that you're grateful for, that really sort of starts to bring you out of that low sort of vibration to help you to really sort of uplift your spirits as well to move into higher vibration. So the angels are saying use gratitude because it, on a daily basis, morning and evening, speak your gratitude, write it down because it will really helps to get you out of those low that low vibration or that feeling of feeling low in your life as well and you know and it will help you to really sort of keep more in that place of feeling better in yourself as well and then the next card that came out is good choices so the angels are saying it's also about making the good choices in your life good choices about moving away from the things that no longer serve you and this may be something that you may be doing you know you may be letting go of those addictions 
uh, working on releasing the low emotions right now, being more in the place of gratitude, making good choices that are helping you to get to where you're truly meant to be. So powerful that this has come out, that you are moving forward towards making those good choices. So use gratitude because when you use gratitude, it will help to uplift your spirits. It will help you to move more towards those good choices as well and to really sort of move towards the life that you truly desire. And that will also bring you confidence as well. You know, it will bring you confidence in yourself, confidence in your abilities, confidence that you are going to achieve through your dreams as well. So, you know, it is about you moving forward with power and strength as a divine feminine, working from the place of gratitude and high vibration. And that will bring in that confidence to help you to move forward. And as you release the things that no longer serve you, that also brings in that confidence for you. And then the next card that came out is reflection. So this is about you taking time to reflect on your life as well. You know, to see why certain things are happening the way that they're happening in your life, to reflect on who you truly are and really work on yourself as well to release the things that you know that no longer serve you. When you take the time to reflect on your life, the things that have happened in the past so that you can release them and really sort of get to that place of finding that inner peace, you know, that stillness. It's a about giving yourself the time of stillness as well in your day rather than rushing around too much if you're working too much you know or you're busy doing a lot of things the angels are saying find that time for yourself to just be in a place of having that stillness and you know and thinking you know you don't have to meditate in that sort of way you can do other things you know you can uh, go for a walk you can be out in nature and just give that time for you to calm yourself down, to calm your mind, to reflect upon things. The more you are in this place of reflecting on your life, the more you're actually going to bring in the, you know, you're going to make the good choices to lead you to where you are. So you may also be in this place right now, Divine Masculine, where you're going through this time of reflection as you make good choices to help you to move forward towards your new beginning. So, you know, doing all these things will move you into your new beginning, but you may actually be in this place where you're walking away from the addictions, the things that no longer serve you, and you are using gratitude more every day. You are in this place of making good choices, and you are in this place of reflecting upon your life, you know, making good choices that are leading you to this new beginning. So really powerful. I really feel that there are others who are needing to work on doing this, but then there are others who are already in this place. That's the message that's coming through. In this place of now you're moving towards your new beginning because you're working on yourself, you're reflecting on your life and you are making good choices that are leading you to that new beginning that you truly desire. So, you know, keep moving forward. Whichever part of your journey you're on, the Angels are saying keep moving forward because you are doing, you are moving towards your new beginning, which is going to bring you that life that you truly desire. And then the cards that came out for you uh, from the uh from the uh the angel prayers. So the first card is Earth Angel. And it says, thank you, angels, for inspiring me to be more like you. So you're being reminded here that you are an earth angel. You are here to do a mission. You are here to help others as a divine masculine. You know, you are here to do a mission by yourself, but also as your mission with your divine feminine as well. So you are an earth angel. So the more you're healing yourself as well, the more you're actually helping to heal the planet. Because as you grow and move forward towards the life that you truly desire, desire as well, releasing the fears, releasing the inner conflicts, releasing sort of, you know, all the things that no longer serve you. The more you become an example for other divine masculines as well, to follow in your footsteps and the more you are there to be in a place of helping others as well, because you are an earth angel and you are here to help others. And the last card that came out is the, the miracle of prayer. And it's Archangel Sandalphon. So Archangel Sandalphon is there to hear your prayers and take them to the creator. So it's about you calling in Archangel Sandalphon for the, asking for the things that you desire, the things that you desire for your life to help you to get to where you're truly meant to be. And it's also remembering that Archangel Sandalphon is the Archangel of music as well, you know, and, you know, the angel of music. So Archangel Sandalphon is there to help you to hear messages in music that are there to guide you on your journey 
is or you may be hearing messages in music that are coming through from your divine feminine as well as uh, you know to help you guide you as well home to to your divine feminine to the life that you truly desire as well so you know archangel sandalphon is is there in your life to help you to take those prayers that you have but also to give you messages through messages in music messages from the angels and also messages from your divine feminine thank you sandalphon for delivering my prayers to heaven so it's about you knowing that when you are asking for things setting intentions praying asking the creator to help you archangel sandalphon is there to deliver those prayers to the creator to help you move towards that life that you truly desire and the cards that came out for you from uh, the divine masculine power messages, you, um, the first one is you have a loving heart. So really, really beautiful. You are an earth angel, divine masculine. You have a loving heart. And you know, because you are a being of love and you are really just learning right now to release the fears, the things that hold you back so that you can be able to operate from the place of love in everything that you do, because that is who you are. You are a being of love and you have a loving heart so whatever you may be going through always remember that you are a being of love and you have a loving heart and the things that have happened or the things that you may see as having done in your life release the blame release and forgive yourself because at the end of the day you have a loving heart those were all just lessons to help you grow and the next cards that came out for you, the last two cards are go forward fearlessly and go for it. So the angels are saying, divine masculine, go forward fearlessly as you make good choices in your life, as you move towards your new beginnings, go for it. You know, go forward fearlessly, release the fear and move forward towards the life that you truly desire and know that great things are coming in for you as you move towards, whether it's your divine feminine, towards a new career, towards your mission. The angels are saying, go forward fearlessly fearlessly go for it because great things are coming in for you i hope you have a great day guys and a great weekend i'll see you on the next video love peace positivity and light